welcome back to my channel so by the title of this video you guys already know this will be the first grocery haul video for the month of march it is a fred meyer grocery haul video i do want to say before we jump into today's video that um for some reason there is something going on with instacart i had to order from three different places and when i went to check out it was telling me one delivery per day so this video might be broken up over the course of two to three days i have my second delivery scheduled for tomorrow and then the third delivery um is scheduled for the day after that i'm just hoping that maybe they have a shortage of drivers out today and tomorrow i can change the third delivery to be delivered with the second delivery tomorrow but in any case i am excited to show you guys what i got for this month in this part one delivery so here we go <laughs> To be daring, baby, dance the night away I let my head down if I want Don't you just get tired chasing fame And being pretty all the time Doesn't sound like fun You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better case of mini Maid pink lemonade um i drank this religiously when i was pregnant with my son in 2021 up until the end of my pregnancy um at around i want to say like february 16th of 2022 and then i gave birth birth to him in march of 2022 and with summer coming i don't want to wait until summer and be struggling to find it here i got two packs of 24 count wild cherry pepsi um my husband is an avid soda drinker i am trying to find ways to get him to cut down but yeah all right so basically starting here um i actually wanted um gordon's um crunchy breaded fish fillets but i guess gordon's was out and so this was the substitution that they gave me. So I'm still gonna try it anyway. I've been having a taste for um, like fish fillets. So yeah. But I will say that is the one frustrating thing when you are doing like online grocery orders to be delivered to your house or your apartment or whatever, you're not physically there in the store to see. Um, maybe the shopper was just overlooking things or maybe the store had more in the back they just hadn't gotten around to bringing them out yet and sometimes the shoppers um aren't willing to take that extra step and ask and so in these cases you know i always try to remind myself you know i'm not personally going in and shopping myself so i can't really complain all that much especially when i did go in and they'll like allow you to make your own substitutions or replacements within the app as well so for me i just take that as if there are things that i know that i'm really 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 want um you know for the future i'm just mindful of those items and i will personally go and try to find and purchase those items myself 
here i did get the yummy brand of chicken fries they are better than the um tyson's chicken fries so last month um i did try the spicy hot version of these and even for me they were just too hot i noticed my daughter did not enjoy her chicken fries as much because they were the spicy version so i think we are just going to stick to the regular version and i will spice them up and season them as i please <laughs> good old red baron so here i got two boxes of five cheese and garlic pizzas um and these are singles it's almost like having a piece of garlic bread and this is so much nicer than having to cook a whole frozen pizza so i got two of those and then i got two of the pepperoni uh version going down here to the yogurt so I got Danimals. Obviously, Danimals are for my toddler, Everly, but her brother is turning one this month, you guys, which means that we can go ahead and just go ham with giving him milk and dairy products, which is why I got three packs. One pack is six strawberry, six watermelon. This pack is six strawberry kiwi, six strawberry. And this pack is six banana and six strawberry. I remember telling you guys in another grocery haul video that I did that my husband made this confession to me that he is in love with sausage. So I went ahead and just ordered one of this um, Johnsonville original recipe breakfast sausage. And since he likes sausage, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be gone in maybe like three days. Here I got two 16 ounce rolls of ground beef. More than likely I will be cooking this ground beef tonight and we will be having stuffed bell peppers. Okay, now this is a lot here, but I have two red bell peppers, two yellow bell peppers, two orange bell peppers, and one green bell pepper by its lonesome. Here I also got four organic bananas. So recently my husband also told me that he's really not that big of a chip eater. Boy, since when? Since when? Let, let me know because since we've been together, he eats chips. Like those are his go-to snacks. But anyway, since he claims that he doesn't really like chips all that much, the chips that I did get, are pretty much for me with the exception of one thing this cheetos cheddar popcorn is for him he's been loving this lately these spicy nacho doritos are for me spicy nacho doritos are my jam and you guys i am so freaking happy because i was able to get a party size bag of the cheddar and sour cream lays and every single time I have ordered groceries, even when I've, you know, done a little mini order, no more of maybe like 20 items, these stores have been out of this specific brand of chip, which makes me sad. And it is a little scary because that speaks volumes about what's going on with their inventory. And I also got these cheddar jalapeno crunchy Cheetos. Now watch you guys, all of these chips, like I said, I got them for myself and watch my husband go ahead and dip his fingers into my stuff. Watch. Moving on. French fries. So they were out of my hand cut style Idaho fries and I'm so sad, but I went ahead and these were the replacements. And so they gave me the Kroger brand of french fries and they also gave me the Kroger brand of seasoned garlic fries so we'll see how these taste I am very interested my curiosity is peaked and you guys know if they are the bomb.com I will not lead you guys astray okay so as soon as I taste them I will let you guys know String cheese. We have been out of string cheese for a week and um, my husband and toddler have been really grumpy and so I'm pretty sure they'll be excited that I got 
some more string cheese i just went ahead and ordered two packs because i'm just like what the hell we're not gonna order one pack and like have to go through this whole shebang okay so i got two of these here i got some colby pepper jack cheese by sargento we needed more shredded cheese in general so i got a craft triple cheddar along with craft colby jack Moving on to Rory, what I got specifically for him. So if you guys have toddlers, like everything that I got for him are lifesavers. I got him, obviously, the Gerber snacks for baby yogurt melts. I got a pack in the mixed berry flavor and I got a pack in the strawberry flavor. Now here we go with these pouches. I have two strawberry banana i have two berry berry i have two peaches and cream and then i have one apple mango strawberry one apple pear peach and i have one apple strawberry banana now these this is my first time really seeing these um so i'm not sure if they're new or not or they just finally made their way to washington state but it's by a brand called serenity kids and it's a pouch that has chicken in it with organic peas and carrots so i got rory two of these i got him two of the beef ones the beef has organic kale and sweet potato you only see one here because i already opened one and gave it to him and he loved it he ate it all and they have a turkey version and the turkey one has organic sweet potato pumpkin and beet and so he also has two of these so i actually think this is nice and will actually complement the gerber pouches because the gerber pouches that i pretty much see are all really fruit based so this is more protein based so i'm happy about that i also got him the soft baked grain bars in the strawberry banana flavor i also did get him the gerber teethers in the banana peach flavor and of course the gerber teethers in the strawberry apple and spinach flavor i got a pack of snickers my husband has been craving snickers and we ran out like five days ago so i also had to get another bag of the white reese's peanut butter cup spins for rory i got him the strawberry apple puffs as well as the blueberry puffs and i don't know why i forgot about this but of course gerber does make juice so i don't know why it slipped my mind but anyway i saw it and so i ordered a bottle of apple juice and a bottle of pear juice for him. So this will be nice, that way he's not drinking milk all day. For a juice for me and the husband, we have um, the Ocean Spray Crayon Pineapple. We also have the Crayon Pomegranate Flavor. I remember drinking this during my teenage years. So um, it's the White Crayon Strawberry by Ocean Spray and it is delicious because we are now an orange juice drinking household i got the tropicana no pulp calcium and vitamin d and then over here i got two gallons of organic valley whole milk so that was pretty much it for this day one delivery for this grocery haul video that was everything i got from fred meyer and I'm going to put the total amount of money that I spent at Fred Meyer somewhere up here. I want to say it was around $375. I could be wrong. Don't worry. Whatever number appears up here, you can be assured that it is correct. Um, and so... I'm just going to close it out here and then we will pick back up when the next set of groceries are delivered tomorrow.
right guys we are back so here is the grocery delivery for day two um and i'm just gonna quickly run through with you guys what i got and it was a split order between qfc and fred meyer starting over here i went ahead and got a box of honey nut cheerios i ate honey nut cheerios religiously when i was pregnant with rory this is my jam um so i got a box of this i also got a box of kellogg's apple jacks cereal i also got this box of cinnamon toast crunch as well here i have some california kitchen pizza my husband loves california kitchen pizzas and this is really really nice for him to have that way if there's a day and i'm not really feeling up to cooking or anything like that he can pop one of these in the oven and he has dinner for himself and our kiddos so I got him two of the barbecue chicken recipe and three of the roasted garlic chicken recipe. Well, these are new to me. I've never really uh, seen these. But what I will say is um, I think they're going to be good. They are milk chocolate and caramel pretzel crisps and they're thin. Um, nice, sweet and salty snack. Waterfront uh, sourdough bread. I went ahead and I got two of the, they're calling it the Amber Edition. It's the um, Strawberry and Apricot Red Bull. This, out of all the Red Bulls, I would say this and the Pomegranate and the um, Blueberry are my favorite. And the Dragon Fruit, so I have a top four. I got a box of rosemary and olive oil Triscuits. This is my husband's go-to snack. And um, he's been really cutting back on eating Triscuits. So next time we order groceries, I will ask him if this is something that's getting played out for him. Um, but he already has a box, so I just went ahead and got him another box. I used to drink naked smoothies back in the day. They used to be my jam, but not so much anymore. But I've really been liking the Bolt House Farms formula of uh, smoothies. So I got one in the flavor green goodness, one in the flavor blue goodness, and one that is a berry boost. I did have to grab some um, disposable gloves. All right, so jumping back on over here, I have my wild Pacific salmon. It is hard to find this salmon, you guys. I just, ugh but um obviously i didn't get it from um fred meyer no honey i was able to find this salmon at qfc and you know what i said i wasn't taking any chances so i got four packs doritos salsa verde chips have also been extremely hard to find and these are my husband's favorite flavor of doritos so i was like yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and get two bags so doritos came out with this sweet and tangy barbecue flavor i have not tried these obviously on the top of the bag it says new flavor so this is the first time that i've seen these i said i was gonna get a bag to try it because why not um but the one thing i will say is i'm gonna be a little bit annoyed if these doritos taste exactly like the sweet and spicy chili because i'm gonna be like come on now <laughs> doritos you gotta do better and then here i have three bags of spicy nacho doritos now don't come for me about these doritos okay so what had happened was um i ordered two bags of salsa verde doritos i ordered that one bag of the sweet and tangy barbecue new flavor and i ordered two bags of spicy nacho doritos and i ordered one bag of the um sweet and spicy chili flavor they did not have the sweet and spicy chili flavor and so instead of the shopper reaching out to me to ask me if there was a different flavor of doritos that they wanted me to grab they just decided to grab an extra bag of spicy nacho doritos which doesn't bother me because i love 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 spicy nacho doritos but it would have been nice to have the sweet and spicy chili doritos but we gonna make it work like I said in the first part, it was wishful thinking, hoping that they were just gonna deliver everything that was remaining today and they are not. So I guess tomorrow I will finish showing you the remaining of what we had for our grocery shopping trip for the first um, of this month. And yeah.
is the day three grocery delivery. This is it. This completes our first round of grocery shopping for the month of March. And I am going to show you guys the rest of what we got. Yeah. So let's just get into it. Starting over here, obviously we did get some more frozen pizza. So I got two more of the California Kitchen barbecue chicken recipe pizzas for my husband. And then I used to love Chuck E. Cheese's pizza as a kid. I don't know what it is about Chuck E. Cheese pizza, but it was always bussin'. And now they're actually selling it in the stores. And with each box that you purchase, you get um, 250 e-tickets. So I'm not really sure what all of that is about, but I did get the classic cheese and the pepperoni. So I'll probably cook one of these for Everly for lunch today and see how it turns out. Of course, I went ahead and I got my wild Pacific salmon. Down here, I went ahead and got some mini croissants. Here, I went ahead and got a little um, 12 pack of King's Hawaiian rolls. Here, I went ahead and I got some Duncan Hines perfectly moist white plastic cake mix and I also got the red velvet cake mix. Here I went ahead and got this six count of honey buns. I might as well take these in my room. They're gonna be for me. I'm the only one in the house that really eats honey buns. And then as you can see here this mound I have six of each flavor. I have six cheddar broccoli rice a -roni cups, six chicken flavored rice a -roni cups, and I also have six creamy four cheese rice aroni cups obviously for the cakes i went ahead and got two um cans of betty crocker rich and creamy vanilla frosting this kettle and fire beef bone broth is something new that i just started seeing um uh, maybe like a couple of months ago and so i do want to give this a try and see how this compares to like the swanson beef broth I went ahead and I also got this 26.5 ounce jar of Nutella. And then, of course, for my husband, I went ahead and I got two jars of the Jif Extra Crunchy Peanut Butter. Moving on over here to the chip section. So I went ahead and I got two bags of the Sun Chips 100% Whole Grain Garden Salsa Flavor. I also got a bag of Funyuns. I got a bag of the party size flaming hot crunchy hot cheetos i went ahead and got a bag of the spicy sweet chili dorito got a bag of the ruffle sour cream and onion i did get two bags of the sun chips 100 percent whole grain harvest cheddar i went ahead and got another bag of the sweet and tangy barbecue doritos i also got a bag of the ruffles baked cheddar and sour cream i went ahead and i also got this jumbo bag of fun size snickers here i went ahead and got some louisiana seasoned crispy fish fry here i had to get more of the hidden valley ranch seasoning because i was all out here is um louisiana hot sauce here i went ahead and got two cans of french style green beans because i love french style green beans and i got two cans of whole kernel corn and then by this little mound that you see here i went ahead and purchased 10 cup of noodles beef flavor and 10 cup of noodles um shrimp flavor of course, here, these are um, paper bowls by Dixie. And then I also got two packs of 48 count Dixie plates. I went ahead and got um, one pack of this Polska kielbasa sausage. My husband said that he likes kielbasa sausage. My husband just comes up with a plethora of new stuff that he likes which is crazy because first it was oh babe i really like sausage i love sausage sometimes i'll sneak and eat the sausage behind your back when you're not looking so maybe that's why you didn't know but i love sausage so that was the first thing then it went from he loves sausage to he loves the johnsonville breakfast sausage that's his favorite and then i want to say a week ago i had cooked some hillshire farm um smoked sausage and it went from him liking the breakfast sausage to him loving the hillshire beef smoked sausage and then it went from that to babe i love all sausage if the category is sausage i love it yeah all right babe okay whatever you say 
I did go ahead and get um, another thing of Johnsonville Original Recipe Breakfast Sausage. I did go ahead and get two, two packs of Top Sirloin Steak. And then I also had to go ahead and get two of the family size things of mega stuffed Oreos. Here, um, I went ahead and got this pack of Bertoli chicken carbonara. And then I also did get a bag of the chicken, florin chicken florentine and farfalle. Here, I went ahead and got a box of strawberry Eggos and blueberry Eggos. Here I have the Gorton's air fried fish fillet. I have some catfish, you guys. Super duper happy. It seems like it's so hard to find catfish in the state of Washington. Here I went ahead and I got another pack of the thick sliced smoked bacon. I also went ahead and got um, butter. I needed more butter. Here I went ahead and got another uh, bottle of caramel macchiato ice espresso, the Starbucks version. I also got this four pack of Starbucks espresso shots. Here I went ahead and I got a tub of the Private Selection Sea Salt Caramel Truffle Ice Cream. I then went ahead and got some Trix yogurt. <laughs> You guys, Trix yogurt was a big part of my childhood personally, and it's just great that they still um, sell these because now my daughter loves Trix yogurt. So me and her, we share this eight pack. So. And then here I went ahead and got two um, eight pack cases of Velveeta cups. Here I have these Comforts baby food puree variety pack pouches. And then over here, I just went ahead and I got two packs of pork chops. Kiddos needed more wipes and we used the Pamper Sensitive. And so I went ahead and got two, three packs. We went ahead and got another two gallons of whole milk. We have a whole, an open gallon of whole milk in the refrigerator right now, but it didn't make sense to buy one gallon of whole milk, knowing that the one gallon of whole milk that we have in the refrigerator is gonna get drinking up in probably the next five days. We are really about to go through milk like nobody's business. We needed paper towel, so I went ahead and got a six pack of paper towel. We also needed trash bags because we were about to run out of trash bags. So I went ahead and ordered a um, 80 count box of hefty, ultra strong, lavender and sweet vanilla scented trash bags. Did go ahead and order two um, 24 can cases of um, Wild Cherry Pepsi. Here, I went ahead and got a 12 pack case of um, Canada Dry. It is ginger ale and raspberry lemonade. And then of course, I went ahead and I got another 40 pack case of um, water from Fred Meyer. So you guys, that is pretty much it from this grocery haul. I will say everything that I just showed you in um, today's grocery delivery for day three, um, all of these items came from Fred Meyer. So again, I am doing my due diligence and doing my best. I will go ahead and put right here how much this individual order did cost. And I'm actually gonna put over here um, what the grand total is that I spent for all of the groceries that you guys have seen in this video um, over the course of the past three days because for whatever reason, Instacart broke my delivery into like a three-day delivery. I, I don't know why I did um, reach out to customer service and ask them and the only answer I got was oh well that would be an extremely big order and um, sometimes we don't have the drivers and we didn't want to run the risk of potentially having no Instacart shoppers uh, pick up the batch order because that is an extremely large order and they would have had to deliver all of that stuff themselves so they said to give me a better chance of being able to have my order done successfully that is why um the system split it into a three-day delivery order but in any case i really do hope that you guys enjoyed this video if this is your first time coming across one of my videos and you enjoyed it and you are intrigued 
go ahead and smash that subscribe button because it's free and it don't cost you nothing and i would love to have you along and make sure you hit that thumbs up button to let me know if you guys are enjoying these type of videos and for my returning subscribers you guys are truly amazing thank you so much for your continued support and your continued encouragement it does mean a lot to me um and with all of that being said i will definitely see you all in the next video I'm talking, talking.